Hey guys, today I've partnered with FabFitFun to review the Winter 2018 box, so stick around. We're doing something a little bit different today, guys, but I hope you'll find this useful, inspirational, and a little bit beautiful, just like everything else on the channel. Hey guys, welcome back. My name is Shada Campbell and on this channel I do art and lifestyle videos with a new video every Friday, so make sure to subscribe if you haven't already. And if you saw the title of this video, I did mention that in addition to reviewing the FabFitFun box, I have some big news to share. Usually I wait until the end of the video to make you watch all the way through, um, but I'm too excited, so I'm gonna share the big news right now. And the news that I want to share with you guys is that in 2019, I'm going to start posting two videos a week. That's twice as many videos. And the reason for doing this is that I want to give you guys what you've been asking for, which is more lifestyle videos, more art tutorials, more tech videos. This way you can find out a little bit more about me. I can teach you what I know about blogging and YouTubing, and I won't have to take away from the art tutorials. So those of you that are here just for those art videos, there will always be an art art tutorial every week and that's not going to change. There's just going to be more content and it's going to be a lot of fun. And that starts today with me uh, unboxing the FabFitFun box and I'm super excited about it. So let's get started. So if you're not sure what FabFitFun is all about, which seems a little unlikely since it's basically the internet's favorite subscription box, it's just that. It's a seasonal subscription box that's full of full-size lifestyle, wellness, and beauty products. Full-size is key. When I was in high school, I would send away for catalogs and sample products, but I think we've all outgrown the sample size product. So the FabFitFun box comes out four times a year, seasonally, and it costs $49.99, but there's over $200 worth of products in here, and honestly, some of them cost $40 or $50 just on their own, so it's a really good value. And right now, you guys can get $10 off your first box with code SHADA. And now FabFitFun gives you the chance to customize the products that you get in your box, which is really nice. You can kind of do an either or. I know last month you could get a coffee press or a teapot. So if you're not a coffee drinker, uh, you don't end up with something that you'll never ever use. So it's nice, it's personal. And I'm gonna take a look and show you guys what's in my box. Okay, so I am ready to open this thing. It feels like Christmas. One of the things I love about this is that I really have trouble spending money on myself. And this is basically just all cool self-care, interesting products just for me. It is like Christmas. Okay, so first of all, what I see right away would have to be this giant throw, which is gorgeous. Let's unroll this. I especially love cozy products in winter. I'm all about that Huga. If you watched the last Bujo video, it's all about the coziness and especially in Canada, it's cold. So this is really gorgeous. This will go perfectly with my very neutral living room. Um, yeah, super soft, very nice. We'll have to set this up in the, sh set this up in the shot. Put it here or something. Okay, let's see what else is in here. So that's pretty cool. Full size throw for the living room, for the end of the bed. Okay, what's next? Let's do something small. We don't wanna do all the big stuff first. Okay, so this is an eye brightener and highlighting stick from Thrive Cosmetics. And they've got a one-to-one -one business model. Um, for every product that is purchased, they donate one to a woman in need. Any business that does a one-to-one -one model, I really love to support. And outside of that, I really need a highlighting stick. I'm all about the highlighters um, over the last year. And this one is super pretty. Good amount of subtle shimmer and blends really nice as well. Okay, the next thing that I see is a lipstick from Bite Beauty. Oh, this is pretty. Good packaging. Oh, very good packaging. I just like a lipstick that looks cute in my purse and this one is like a matte black, really simple, not flashy, I love that. 
And the color's quite pretty, a nice nude, sort of peachy, sort of pinky. I've definitely been a fan of the no makeup makeup look for the last 20 years, so this will be a go-to for me for sure. Okay, next in here, I have a Moroccan Argon Oil treatment mask, hair treatment mask for dry and damaged hair. That's pretty cool. I mean, I have short hair, obviously, always have actually for like 15 years, so I'm not into hair products as much. This is probably one that I could have done in either or, but this is my first box. Um, but still, I do have blonde hair, so a little treatment probably doesn't hurt, really doesn't hurt. And Chris is actually growing his hair out now because I just think boys with long hair are so pretty. Um, so maybe, maybe this could be a stocking stuffer for Chris. His hair is getting long. Um, but also I read in the catalog that this is a $49 value. So this is actually something that I'd feel really good about giving to a friend for a Christmas gift because I know that it's, you know, it's a full size product, good value, and it smells really good. I feel like I can already smell it. Mm, yeah. <laughs> That does smell really good. I'm not into fruity smells. Maybe I will have to keep that. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, anyway, I'm not into fruity smells. I love anything that smells clean, like soap, and that smells so good. Let's see here. We have two essential oils from Elevate. Very nice. One is eucalyptus and one is sweet orange. Oh, that's cool. Wow, essential oils are really expensive. There's something that I love to have, but I hate to buy. And I mean, I love to have them. I use essential oils to make my own cleaning products with vinegar um, so that I'm not buying expensive products. I use essential oils to make my own body scrubs and lip glosses. So I use them, but I still hate buying them. So that's pretty cool. I honestly, I know I would spend like 30 or $40 just on these. Um, um, because that's just how much I always spend on them. So very cool. Uh, eucalyptus, I love. Eucalyptus is great because I actually will use it in the cleaning products because it really cuts through the smell of the vinegar that I use to make kitchen sprays and so that you don't just smell vinegar. Um, so that's really nice and it's great for cold when you want to take a bath when you're sick. And then sweet orange. Oh, that's really good. Sweet orange, I just love anything citrus because it goes really well with coconut oil and I use coconut oil often to make my lip balms and scrubs. So citrus, coconut, great smell combo. But yeah, I'm gonna get a ton of use out of those. Those are not going in any one sock. Those are just for me. Okay, next we have a Jade Stone Roller and it says in the catalog that this is an anti-aging beauty tool that promotes a feeling of facial relaxation. I think I can say this isn't really my thing, but I'll put it in the category of trying something I otherwise wouldn't, which this box is really great for. Okay, so we have a hydration cream mask from Ahava. This is one of the items that's in every box this season and that's kind of nice because it is winter and it's so cold and that cold winter air is misery for your skin. In Charlottetown right now, it's I think it's like minus eight today or something and that's Celsius. That's like super cold in Fahrenheit. So hydration cream mask, um, put it on for three to five minutes, or you can leave it all night. That's crazy, that is commitment if you can sleep with a face mask on. Um, but I may have to by the end of this winter, we'll see how it goes. Okay, still got a few more things in here, which is kind of crazy. So next is black activated charcoal eye mask with hyaluronic acid. That's pretty cool. I feel like I've seen stuff like this online, those black eye masks that go under your eyes. Um, everything is activated charcoal now, and I haven't really tried anything other than the toothpaste, uh, which I couldn't really wrap my head around. So this will be cool. I'm excited to try this. I've seen, seen some of these kind of thing on Instagram so that's cool. All right, time for the last item in the box. There was actually more in here than I expected. Um, so this I know is a jewelry portfolio from Halston and it's all wrapped up so I'm just gonna unpackage it. But yeah, I honestly can't believe how much stuff is in this box. You know, part of the way that YouTube works is that we do partner with companies and we do sponsored videos, but I only show you guys 
products that I really love and believe in. And honestly, I was on the fence about uh, this one just because I hadn't tried it. Obviously, this is my first time opening a box. And my initial thought was, I'm sort of a minimalist. Do I want a box of stuff coming once a season? Um, and when I did the research and started looking at other YouTube reviews and videos, I was amazed at the amount and quality of the items in the box. The fall box in 2018 looked so good. There was a beauty blender. There was some great makeup. There was, um, oh, what was it? there was headphones that I really wanted and I was just sold. So I'm super excited to be unboxing this today and this is really cool. This is just, just that same feeling. This portfolio is something that I really need. I'm doing a lot of traveling this winter. I have a work trip in January and then actually I haven't told you guys this yet, but Chris and I are going to Paris for the whole month of February and we're gonna be working there and running the YouTube channel from there. So this is just the perfect thing that I can keep all my jewelry organized. My necklaces won't get tangled. It's small enough that I can put it in my carry-on because I never check my jewelry when I travel. Um, yeah, so just like so much cool stuff. And this is exactly that feeling when I watched those reviews of the fall box, that thing that you're like, wait, I really want that, I really wanted this. So, very cool. I am super excited about all these products. I'm gonna put that hair mask in Chris's stocking, just don't tell him. All right, that's it guys. I have to say, this was the first FabFitFun box that I was sent to review, and after this experience, I'm really sold. I love that these are products that I wouldn't normally splurge on, and so it becomes this really cool self-care treat with all these full-size products. And I also read that most of the products come from female-run companies, which I think is amazing. Remember the winter box has just been released. Sign up now so you don't miss out on getting to customize it with your favorite products. Oh, and I have my holiday giveaway going on right now. If you missed it in the last video, you can leave a comment below and click the link in the video description to enter. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe and I'll see you Friday with a new video.